What's going on guys? Jay Hoyt back with you today. Welcome back to Fortnite Battle Royale. We're actually playing squads, I believe, in this one. Playing with a friend of mine. But as we uh, approach this game, you know, something that I've been noticing a little bit recently, and I just noticed it more specifically last night than anything, so I made a huge video, right, about skill-based matchmaking being taken out of the squad's playlist. Now, here's the thing. I like that change, right? I think there should be an option that you can take off skill-based matchmaking or not. But here's the big thing. So last night, I was playing Fortnite with Ben, right? Obviously, we thought or assumed this uh, skill-based matchmaking was still taken out from squads so we were duo squatting so it was myself and ben versus the squads playlist now here's the problem with fortnite in chapter two that they stopped doing patch notes and even though there's some people that you know are able to put on reddit or, or wherever else that they can figure out the changes or if there's changes in different places or stuff being added or or, or whatnot, you know, things just kind of appear and, uh, you know, people will make a post about it or whatever the case is. And something as big as skill-based matchmaking, you have to have that known to people. Because if you're, cons like, going out there and solo squatting or duo squatting and you're just trying to face those easier opponents and those people, you know, in random ranks and skill-based and everything then like that's your whole goal right is to just kind of slay out pubs like pub stomp if you will you know a term from call of duty where you just go out and slay a bunch of you know random not as good players but when they took it out of fortnite skill based matchmaking and then they only took it out of squads it was like okay then it's gonna you know hopefully have more people playing squads but then all of a sudden now i don't know 100 percent that it, they did put it back in but last night, every team that we encountered was extremely sweaty. Now, it could have just been when we were landing, because we do land it, you know, the more, I guess you'd say, hot drops. But there was not any bots. There was no, like, just terrible teams. And, like, there was players that, you know, weren't really the greatest. But, like, you know, they were closer to our skill level than not, I should say, right? They actually had a somewhat of an idea of, of what they were doing in game and you know if they put it back in right if they put skill based matchmaking back in you know obviously I disagree with that uh, you know decision but I would like to know about it right because that would just be like oh I can just play duos instead right there's no point to playing squads you know if there's if it's gonna be the same playlist as duos I mean obviously if you're absolutely insane then, you know, you could probably get away with playing duo squads on the regular with skill-based matchmaking. But especially when they don't really announce anything anymore, right? The only thing they really announce are, you know, events happening in-game or, you know, dramatic changes that, uh, you know, are going to change the whole landscape of the game. But I just don't know what it is. I mean, uh, you know, I don't think there's anything wrong with having patch notes and having people be like, okay, you know, we nerfed. Uh, this gun because it was overpowered and you know what they did to it so just say if they uh, you know decrease the base damage of, uh, of a shotgun or or uh, of an AR or whatever the case is you know I would like to know that right I'd like to know what they changed so that way you know just say if it's a big change that has to do with just say with the shotguns right one's a pump shotgun one's a tactical shotgun you know obviously people are going to use the tack right now because you can get more shots off and rather than just go for the one kind of big hit that uh you know there'd be a big change with the pump just say if it just got like, significantly better or if the attack got significantly better you want to know that right and i you know not having patch notes uh is kind of frustrating the fact that you don't know what you know epic is changing on a day-to-day -day basis but as uh, as frustrating as it is we're just gonna have to live with it as we go here but we end up securing the victory there at the end of the game but as always guys if you did enjoy hit the like button down below if you haven't already hit the subscribe button and as always guys we'll see you next time